this year for Christmas, I definitely got Nick a present that is definitely for both of us rather than just for him. We are going to go and see two glaciers today by helicopter via the company Glacier Helicopters, not Spawn. Um, we're going to go and see Franz Joseph, which is also the town that we are staying in right now. And Fox Glacier via helicopter, we have a half an hour tour and I'm not sure which of the glaciers, but we get to land on one of them and go for a little bit of a walk around. So this is something that I have always really wanted to do and especially after going to Iceland and seeing a couple of the glaciers there, I just think it's going to be something that's going to be like a really epic way to end off 2019. Franz Josef is a pretty small town so you can't fly directly into Franz Josef from anywhere else in New Zealand. There are a few other places that are maybe like an hour or so away that you can fly into but because there are also small towns the cost of those flights is not always direct and it's also quite expensive so we opted instead to fly into Christchurch and yesterday to make the four and a half hour drive from Christchurch to Franz Josef. So basically we went from like the east coast of New Zealand to the west coast. Helicopter glacier flights are obviously dependent on the weather and although today was a beautifully sunny day after a really terribly rainy day yesterday as we started going up on our flight the cloud cover came in so we weren't able to land in one of the landing spots but we were still able to go past our uh, Fox Glacier and Franz Josef which was really cool uh, and it's still a really epic trip. Just in case we weren't able to do our helicopter flight this morning, I booked us a return flight back to Wellington from Christchurch for tomorrow evening. So we have all day tomorrow to road trip across the South Island, uh, stopping in at a bunch of different places along the way. And then for the rest of today as well, I wasn't sure if we were going to get like delayed for our flight or not. So I think we might go for another little bit of a mini road trip today and just see more of the West Coast while we're here. <laughs> stop on our little mini road trip for today is Lake Matheson. On a completely still day Lake Matheson almost is like a mirror so you can see all of the mountains like Mount Cook and stuff reflecting in the water. Today was a little bit windy but pretty cool view nonetheless. There is a bunch of different walks you can do around Lake Matheson. Some of them are like an hour or so, some of them take a little bit longer. We just chose to do the like loop track which is about 45 minutes to the first lookout uh, and now we're walking back. Okay, we are now at the Franz Josef Glacier we went um, as far as like Bruce Bay I think it was called. We got an ice cream, we had a drink, we changed drivers and now we have come back to look at this little lookout. It's raining but we have jackets so I'm sure we will be fine. Today is another little 30 minute loop track and it's called the Terrace Walk. Don't really know what we're going to see along here but it just looks absolutely gorgeous so we figured why not get in a few more steps. <laughs> as this walk is I also feel like it's kind of the beginning of a horror story with just this thin little path. All right we have just made it back to our accommodation it I think it's like just gone four o'clock um but we're gonna have a little bit of a chill out before we head out for dinner later on and I've got a whole bunch of brochures and stuff from the information information center rather um that we're gonna use to plan our road trip back to Christchurch tomorrow so I think I might just end today here and I'll see you tomorrow for day two of the South Island road trip. Good morning everybody and welcome to the start of our road trip day two. <laughs> All 
All right, we have been driving for about an hour and 40 minutes and then we just saw this place which says it's a treetop walk. So we figured we would come and check it out and stretch our legs. really fun they gave us one of these brochures which has a bunch of like information about the flora and the fauna and the structure itself um, but it was just really nice and peaceful and a good way to just uh, as I said get some steps in get some exercise and also just see a bunch of lovely New Zealand native bush now we're gonna hop back in the car and the next stop is going to be Greymouth which I think is like 40 minutes to an hour away okay we basically didn't even stop in Greymouth it was where um, Nick was living for a bit when he did the training for the job that he has now so he wanted to show me like uh, where he did the training where he used to live and stuff like that so we might swing by on the way back because we are basically running out of fuel um, but we have come on a very out of the way detour to Punakaiki which is a place that we have both been uh, for me when I was younger it's like all these really cool pancake rock formations and it's on the coast and it's an absolutely beautiful day so we figured we may as well <music> It has just gone 1.14, we've just filled up some petrol and also picked up some pretty classic Kiwi road trip snacks. Sorry, I know those bags are really loud. Um, of a potato top pie for me and a mince and cheese pie for Nick. Now we have a like three hour drive through Arthur's Pass back to Christchurch and we might stop at some little like walks and little stuff along the way. Uh, a good like two hours before we need to be at the airport so I think we might just uh, head into the city have a little bit of a walk around see what's around um, that also brings us to the end of our road trip hopefully you have enjoyed this little bit of a South Island road trip video it was really fun to film some more travel content it's been a while since we've been on a trip like this I think this is the first video of mine that you'll be seeing for 2020 so I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas and a safe and happy New Year's uh, and yeah your 2020 is off to a good start and I will see you all next week with a another video bye